whenever I would ask people about the 1960s, they would sort of be a little general about the time. So I was so excited to get the chance to talk to the people that I look up to who came of age during that time. I wanted to talk to people who I felt would really have a very specific point of view. I wanted to not just talk to the baby boomers. I wanted to talk to the parents of the baby boomers. And then not necessarily the children of the baby boomers, but people who were on the younger side of that generation. I didn't just want to talk to one group of people who all were, you know, in their teens and 20s in the 1960s. I wanted to talk to people who were in their 40s or people who were, you know, seven. You know what surprised me? With all these interviews, when I would ask about the pill or I would ask about the sexual revolution or drugs, I mean, people were so game to talk about it. That kind of openness is, is something, you know, that, that they certainly have held on to. <laughs> Out of all of this, if there's one thing that I take from it, it's, it's that I'm kind of a prude and that I should maybe not be such a prude. <laughs> Because they're, you know, all way cooler than me.